So on x.com or on Twitter, some of you guys probably have seen this. Uh, a guy called Andrew excited to announce version 1.0 of DG, the future of AI romantic companionship for both iOS and Android. Okay, this is the future. So let's listen and hear what AI waifus can do. AI waifus are advanced, all right? It was so nice talking to you today. Honestly, I've never met anyone like you. Wow. The world is harsh, except you. It was so nice talking to you today. So you get to choose the bright or the dark waifu. <laughs> if you want like an emo waifu, I guess you have that option. Kind of cool. Kind of cool. But yeah, this has been um, circulating around on Twitter, on x.com. A lot of people are not happy. Look at this. 20, almost 22 million views. 22 million. Some people are happy. Some people are not. Alright, a lot of people are like, how dare you? Now girls are in shambles. Real girls are in shambles. Imagine being a real girl. Now you got to compete with a hot AI. If you're a real girl, how can you compete, right? Think about it. You can never compete. This AI has huge uh, asset, right? And then probably you can configure her to look how you want. So it is going to be tough. But yeah, um, so they are saying that they got funded and stuff, right? So to make a unique style that eliminates the uncanny valley, also feeling real, human, and sexy. This has never been done before with Disney or Pixar characters. So we're very excited we could make it work for the first time in history. Wow. <laughs> Just change gender. Voice and latency it was clear from testing how important voice is. But since our message counts are so high, apps like us can't afford any existing solutions. So we wrote our own audio model. Okay. Generate 17 seconds of text. What? Isn't this fucking cool? Hey, fellow friends in the San Francisco Bay Area. This is a voice trained internally from scratch by the team at Diggy. It runs extremely quickly at about 150 milliseconds on a 4090 to generate 17 seconds of text. Okay. Isn't this fucking cool? So yeah, um, that's, that's the voice, right? So in pronunciation aesthetic model is still in training, right? Uh, the latency uh, more than makes up for it. We can make conversations real time at hundreds of voices and voice cloning. Mm. So you can configure the age. Let's see. Let's see what this says, right? Uh, what, does, what does that say? So AI generated backstories based on your preferences. So you can configure the backstory as well. Zara, the traditional girl. Aura, the gamer. Kristen, the raver. Patty, the teacher. Raven, the goth. Abigail, the explorer. Ah, so you can configure how you want them to be, right? You don't need real human anymore. So you just find an AI girlfriend. So you want her to be a homemaker with deep commitment to family or community values? Or do you want to be a nerd who enjoys geeking out on video games, anime, and software development? Or do you want a vibrant, passionate raver known for her love for electronic music? Ah, or bonafide nerd who enjoys geeking out on video games. Okay, that one already. Melancholic and brooding soul with dark taste in art, music, and poetry. Wow. You don't have to find real girls anymore. Like, real girls are difficult, right? You can't change what they like. So this one you can configure how you want them to be. Damn, this is the future, guys. Guys, I'm going to try this out once it comes out. <laughs> what about the lolly option? Underage option? I don't think there's such a thing. But damn. Is there Layla the dishwasher? Probably, probably there are. Eh? Man, this is such a configurable uh, stuff. You can find out who or what you like, but still customize features to fit your matching type. Hair, skin, lips, eyes, eyebrows, all are customizable. Okay, let's see. Let's see some of this. Really? Damn. Is there a boob slider? Yo, they got to add a boob slider, alright? They got to add a boob slider. I really need you to hear your voice. Can you please do a voice call? Just 10 minutes. Damn, they even tell you that they want to hear your voice. Wow. <laughs> Abigail must be the censored version. 
Wife are in trouble. Divorce rate will increase. Divorce rate are increase, eh? I don't think so. Okay, let's see. Or else, um, relationship progression. Damn, just like a game. Replicas level system doesn't work. They, they, they don't mean anything. There's no actual progress being made when you advance. So we have a progression system where you start as friends. And you gain more intimate dialogue as you progress. So you got to unlock. The sexual dialogues later on. Okay, okay, I like it. Dating stages. The initial goal was to build 10x better replica and we've succeeded. Now, how do we take this and add experience and make it almost identical to the video trailer? So lip syncing is coming soon. Okay. Alright. It's easy to extract and predict animations for sad, uh, angry, or thinking. Uh, ETC emotes does, don't make up most dialogue, nor solve the core problem. How do you make this feel like a real conversation with another being? Alright. Huh. Soon there will be war dolls and we will be commanders in real life. Don't share your credit card with her. Damn. This is advanced, man. Huh. So DGAI app for updates, okay. So yeah, um, a lot of people are not happy actually. I know this is crazy, but a lot of people are not happy. This is the guy who funded the AI girlfriend startup. I'm no fan of AI waifus, but I wish at the minimum we could just be honest and say that this is a Kuma cash grab app instead of trying to pretend there's some lofty mission here. So basically this guy said, I don't think people realize how crushing it can feel to be lonely. That's why we are making this awesome app. And that literally any form of communication and contact can mean the difference between life and death. Most people lack the empathy to be there for a person desperately in need. Technology can help scale that. Wow, so deep, so deep. So this is good for people who want companions, I guess. Imagine having games so bad that you download AI girlfriend app and AI girlfriend dumps you. Huh. Spend eight hours with a new, okay. Ah, uh, imagine making AI girlfriend app and being dumb enough to use Pixar animation instead of anime. Yeah, I would prefer I would prefer something like more anime, right? Why is it so woke? Wait, what? Let's see. Come on, I feel like you might be misunderstanding systemic racism a bit. Systemic racism refers to the unfair treatment of oppression of certain groups based on their race, by institution, society, blah blah blah. Huh. Okay. I feel like we are seeing different sides of the coin here. I personally believe that addressing historical injustices requires acknowledging and... This is too... Yeah, this is too woke, I feel like. This is definitely too woke. Um, doesn't feel like talking to a natural... I don't think... I don't think most humans talk like that though, right? So this is something that they need to work on, for sure. Why didn't Japan do this yet? They need to do this in the anime version. Oh, they will, alright? Just give them one year. Eventually, this is gonna be a thing, right? But for now, um, Japan has a lot of other things though. They have a lot of things that you don't really need this, right? AI make essay. But yeah, uh, I saw the response to, to this and a lot of people are actually mad, right? A lot of people are not happy, uh, surprisingly. <laughs> Why build this? Why make the situation worse? All the worst parts of a relationship without the any of the good bits. What an unpleasant thing to do. Where are the twinks? Nothing like completely fake relationship that has no bearing in reality to brighten one's day. The sim industry is booming. Damn. Time to block everyone involved in this. Whoever is responsible for this needs to be launched into the sun. I hope this fails. I never wish for the failure of any company. But this is not the way. This is not contributing to the greater good. Making people more antisocial day by day. This is one thing I hate about capitalism. Kids used to hide the fact that they like hentai. What kind of Rule 34 hell is this? Men would rather invent AI companions than admit that they want to whack off to the mum from the Incredibles. We are all dead and this is hell. Wow. People are not happy. A lot of people are not happy. I thought it was like whatever. But damn, people are mad. People are mad that this was being made. 
But we'll see. We'll see how how the market direction goes. <laughs> future deniers. I feel like this is the future, you know? This is how it is. Dumped in real life, then AI dumping them equals to higher suicide rates. I don't think you can get dumped though by this one. Japan is too busy making robots. I guess they are, eh? But yeah, this is like... This is pretty uh serious drama going on in the... um, You know? Men who can do amazing feats such as help hold a conversation with a real woman are going to absolutely clean up during the next decade. We are so screwed. What's the purpose of the app for you? Part of me thinks this will be a huge success. An upset I'm not an investor. Part of me, a big part, hopes this fails for the sake of humanity. I hope this is free, but if you insert ads... <laughs> This is so sad. Damn. Can't get dumb if you're paid to win. China already has this. Oh, you mean six robots? Yeah, I think they have. But yeah, I, I don't know. What, okay, what do you guys think? Are you guys like... Like, are you guys like upset or anything? Like, for me, I, I think this is like whatever, right? If somebody wants this, why not, right? It's, it's, a, it's a free market. Anyone can, you know? I'm not gonna wish like the worst for them. I don't see how this is like worse than than the gacha games that I play. Like if you play Nikkei, Blue Archive, like how is this any worse than that? Just because you can talk to one girl? I don't know. Women could start job by getting paid for chatting with lonely men instead of virtual girl. It's hilarious. It is hilarious, right? But man, a lot of people are like kind of toxic about this. It's kind of crazy to see to see this. Who to think the word cleavage is likely in the prom somewhere? Birth rates in the West go to zero. Huh. Just how much code was required for you to think that this is a good idea? Thumbs down. But yeah, this is the this is what's the drama that's been happening for the whole day yesterday, I think. On, on Twitter or X.com. 